Paul, you were telling me about this customer that was using Datadog and New Relic for years, couldn't solve an issue for many months, moved to ground cover, solved it in three hours. Tell me more about this. Yeah, very large uh, B2C customer, massive scale of, of data. They had been using Datadog and New Relic both in prod for over three years, very heavily sampling how much logs they sent to Datadog because indexing logs is very expensive as is storing them for a long period of time. Um, they were sending some log data to New Relic as well. But they also had an open search cluster that they were running. Like most customers, they started in a lower environment. They installed the ground cover. I saw that we provided incredible context out of the box with zero configuration with logs, metrics, and traces. And they moved to prod and they noticed some things that were happening where they had a very large amount of container restarts, of out of memory errors, things like that that were happening kind of below the radar. But it had a significant cost uh, to the company that uh, they weren't aware of. And they literally said to us, like, look, we have been running Datadog and New Relic in Prod for over three years, and we never knew this was going on. We found it in the first 15 minutes of using Ground Cover. We had the problem solved within the first few hours of going into Prod. They're actually sending more data to Ground Cover than they were sending to all three platforms combined. And that's possible because of the unique pricing. Can you tell me more about that? Grunker has a unique bring your own cloud architecture, yet still we manage it for you like a SaaS-like product. So you kind of get the best of both worlds. When we run the backend on your cloud using state-of-the-art open source technologies, we're on the same side as you. We're not making money off of cloud storage and cloud compute. And because our backends are so efficient, you are able to send more data to the, the backend than you're used to because you're not managing towards a budget. It allows us to decouple from volume-based pricing, which is unique to ground cover. So we only charge based on the number of nodes that you've deployed the eBPF sensor, right? If your metric cardinality goes up 5X or the business asks you for custom metrics, you don't have to worry about how that's going to impact your commercial costs. If you want to send, you know, a terabyte of log data per day today and next quarter, it ends up being three terabytes of data. There'll be no commercial increase if you're not monitoring more nodes with ground cover. 